First of all, man, I want to say rest in peace to Keisha Cole's mama, Frankie. Um, I want to say thank you for them early 2000s. You know what I mean? Even when I was in Job Corps, y'all had that BET special. You know, Keisha Cole and her family. And you were pretty to me. People would make fun of Frankie and shit and whatever, bro. I, she was always pretty to me, bro. Like, yeah, most of the people who follow this platform, shout out to the Smoke Gang members. Shout out to the people who donated. It was my birthday yesterday. I want to thank to everybody who wished me a happy birthday on the Instagram. Thank you very much. Um, you see, when you're celebrating a birth, another life surpasses. And I think it's still a celebration even when you pass. Now, unfortunately, the rumor, I'm going to say allegedly because I wasn't there with Frankly, uh, Frankie. They saying she died through a drug overdose. I'm going to pretend I don't know if she's on drugs or not. I've never seen her take coke or this and that. So I'm not going to do them type of rumors. If her family and friends want to do that or you bloggers want to do that, I'm not going to do that. What I will use this time to say is your daughter is hell of impressive, Frankie. Your daughter came from them slum slums, even when she was a young girl in the studios with Tupac and all these legend people, Danny Boy, Mary J. Blythe. She's kept her dream and even reached to the top. Even with a mother who was still going through her own struggles in life, your kids made it. To me, that's the truest accomplishment that any mother can do. Now, people are going to be like, she's not the one who gave the talent. Look, your parents are the people who put you through a certain struggle that builds the character that you are today, bruh. So when we losing Frankie, you know, it's a way of telling Keisha Cole, you went through the strife and the pain. I don't know how you feel. I don't want to know how you feel. My mom and dad is still here, still doing all right. Let me knock on wood. And I hope it keeps like that. I'll get broken. If something happened to my parents, I don't even want to think about that day. And it's like, man, my kids are going to look at me as a leader, so I got to be a leader. I don't want to think about that. Losing Frankie is sad enough. And my only thing to Keisha Cole and her sisters is, you know, brothers, be, be, be strong right now. People going to play with the name of your mom right now. This is a nasty industry. They play for keep over here. All these, especially the media that ain't us, is going to do you wrong. And you know, that, that's not going to even hurt me when I see the European media, what they're going to say about your mom, the drugs and all that. That's normal. But what's weird is, it's always our community shitting on each other. Right now, we're supposed to take this time out and see that Keisha Cole going through a lot right now. But folks and them are going to use that opportunity to say the mom's a crackhead. She's this and that. I seen more people talking about Whitney Houston's alleged drug incidents than everything she established out here throughout her legacy when she was here. More folks talk about all these great greatness that we had about their drugs and downfall. I understand you got to talk about the drugs to motivate people and wake them up and re refrain themselves from doing that. But can't you wait later to do that? Some of you lame niggas had distasteful blogs, man. First of all, shout out to the people who reached out to me on the email and gave me this video. I, I seen it already, but it feels good when Smoke Gang lets me know. Um, Y'all also do me a favor and hit that like button, hit that notification button. I'm still rocking out on this video, but this is a brief intermission. Hit that like button for me right quick. This is about a beautiful queen that's known as Frankie and her beautiful daughters and her kids, man. Now, Frankie brought something to BET that they didn't know how to use. This is right through the transition when BET was selling it to um, Johnson and the, Johnson's family was selling it to Viacom or whatnot. You had a, a, a award winning hit show that was Keisha Cole's show. And I think if it wasn't for Keisha feeling insecure and embarrassed at times, that show would still be here today. Now, Keisha, if I'm wrong, let me know and I'll clarify that. But I'm saying it all with love. Your mom was a personality. All I seen was a mom that liked to smile. I didn't see the headaches or the heartaches because I choose to ignore that because that's part of life. What part of life we don't go through up and downs like that? So I will say, Keisha Cole, your mom seen greatness in the beginning, like way before this thing was even exuded and exhibited out. So you're going to have to be prepared. There's going to be people that look like you and me that's going to disrespect that beautiful lady up and down, through and through. They going for it probably right now. I'm pretty sure you're, you're aware of it. And our community is disgusting when it comes to that, man. Frankie don't deserve that because y'all don't know her in real life. You only hear rumors and what you think you know of her. She dated a lot of young niggas, but a lot of you niggas' mamas is dating folks in them down the street who's 20 years younger than her. So if that's the only thing you can say about her when she dies, then she did a good job. If the only thing you can say about somebody is talk about what they did or been through, that person won already. I personally feel that way. Know what I'm saying? I really personally feel that way. Rest in peace to Frankie. Rest in peace to everything they got going on. Um saddened because it's like you don't pay attention to people you forget them at times and we seem to only remember and bring them up is when they die 
Look, Keisha Cole, I hope you are all right. Your voice is like an angel, and please don't stop the dream you gave us of your singing sensation that you are. I'm your God bless one, man. Thank you for watching another video of I Smoke Hip Hop Live. Love your family, love your kids, and stay blessed, gang.